And thanks for staying with us. Now moving on with more news. On May 31st, the Media and Climate Change Workshop held by SPREP and the Australian Government in Samoa wrapped up the week's activities with a guest panel of speakers, including an environmental specialist, a climate change journalist, and one of Samoa's youngest green activists. Brianna Fryan, a 15-year-old environmental activist, is a passionate environmental advocate who has been doing community-based work since she was 10 years old. Recently, Brianna became Samoa's 350.org coordinator. This past March, she led 250 preschoolers and the Manu Samoan rugby team in the performance of a Samoan warrior dance for the 350.org Pacific Warrior Day of Action. Here's more on Brianna's inspiring story. My name is Brianna Fruin. I am 14 years old and this has been my journey. I've always been interested in environmental work ever since I was little. At six years old, I used to sneak into climate change seminars and listen in to all the leaders to talk about their problems and their solutions to remedy the effects of climate change. I have been to a few conferences throughout my journey. I, my first conference was in Korea, Daejeon. It was funded by United Nations Environmental Program. It was a part of the Children's Division. There I met a lot of like-minded people and I got introduced to 350.org. It's actually a funny story. I wasn't meant to go to the 350.org workshop. It was actually by accident. I was late to my other workshop and I got locked out. And the only workshop that was open was 350.org. I went in and that was the start of my whole 350 movement and journey. My second conference was in Japan, where I met a lot of my friends that I met in Korea and a lot of new people. I went to seminars on ways that youth can be empowered and a lot of workshops on other actions we can do to help climate change or to help our islands and our countries. My latest conference was in Rio, which was the conference Rio Plus 20. I went as a Pacific media person. I wrote three stories a day and a personal blog that was submitted in the local observer here in Samoa. As well as other conferences, I've had two big 350 movements. My first one I did, well, my first small one was a 10-10-10 tree planting where we planted 350 native trees. I went there with my environmental group and family and friends and it was a great initiative and a great day. My second one was Moving Planet where we did a march to show that we can use anything other than you know, cars or other sorts of vehicles that burn gas. So we did a march all the way along the seawall here in Samoa. My final project and my project I just recently did was Connect the Dots where we did a fun run. We ran all the way from um, from the start of the seawall to the end where the Port Authority was and also it promoted a lot of fitness to the local people and that was my latest one from this year. The reason why I'm into climate change and why I'm so passionate about fixing it is because I feel that I am so blessed to live in a country and a place like Samoa which is really a true paradise and the Lord gave this to us to take care of. He gave it to us as caregivers and I think it's our job to keep it the way it is for us and also for future generations to come. My name is Brianna Fruin and I'm with 350.org. <laughs> 